is WJZ TV, Baltimore. In your community, where you live. Now, it's WJZ, Maryland's news station. A popular rapper raises his voice against a silent killer. I'm Pat Warren. Coming up on Eyewitness News, Philly's Freeway in Baltimore for dialogue and dialysis. A new ambassador for health brings an urgent message to Baltimore. The Philadelphia rapper Freeway was in concert in Baltimore on Sunday, the day he was back for dialysis. Pat Warren reports he's raising awareness about chronic kidney disease. Using his voice for a career and a cause. My name's Freeway. I'm going to be here for a while. And I hope when y'all hear this rap, it makes everybody smile. All right, Freeway! In September of last year, rapper Freeway born William Roberts was diagnosed with end-stage renal failure. His visit to MedStar Good Samaritan Hospital is part of a documentary about his life after his diagnosis. I actually have three risk factors. I have high blood pressure, diabetes, and I'm an African American. Kidneys clear waste products out of the blood. Keeping them healthy means a dialysis machine won't have to substitute. Nice to meet you, The 38 year old Freeway hopes to reach others who, like himself, may spend too long ignoring their health. So, anybody with um, a family history of kidney disease, diabetes, high blood pressure, um, those people in particular really need to make sure that they get routine checkups to be assessed for the earliest signs of what could eventually be signs of kidney disease. The disease brings freeway to dialysis four hours a day, three days a week. He admits to having done some, in his own words, inexcusable things growing up. Now he's trying to live up to a promise to give back. I'm Pat Warren reporting. Now back to you. According to the National Kidney Foundation, 26 million Americans have kidney disease and most don't know it.